It's the game. Ohio State, Michigan, this Saturday. First year, not on ABC, with Fox taking over the coverage. I'm Ralph Michaels in studio with Kelly and Marco, and we are talking, of course, Ohio State and Michigan. We know that Michigan has nothing really to play for except beating Ohio State. With that being said, that's enough. Can they do it? Man, I said that last week that they got to play spoiler to <laughs> Wisconsin, and there I was holding the losing ticket. Um, I mean, I know Peters went out due to uh, excuse me concussion protocol, but that was still a really brutal loss. I thought I handicapped it well, and I was wrong. So here I am looking, going, do I lay the 11 and a half with the Buckeyes team? You have Urban Meyer, who we've seen since they lost to Iowa three weeks ago, say, guess what? We have got to keep our foot on the gas. We have got to make a point and say, hey, guess what, committee? We deserve to be that two-loss team that gets in. You know, we had kind of talked in between videos whether Ohio State has the fan backing and the money and the resources to be able to leapfrog someone. We don't know necessarily if they do, but I think that Urban Meyer is still going to play as if they do. Um, Man, it is really, really tough. The Buckeyes have just owned the series. They've covered seven of their last ten against the Wolverines. I am a dog better, but this week I do not like a lot of dogs. Marco, help me out here. Well, I'm going with the home dog here, and I know that Ohio State needs to win this game. They need to go to the Big Ten Championship, take care of Wisconsin. And, Kelly, I was like you. If you told me – that you're going to get a ticket plus seven and a half and the other team's only going to score 24 points. I'm taking that ticket all day long. And the Michigan defense did hold Wisconsin to 24 points. As has been the problem with Michigan all year, they, have, they weren't able to score. And that's going to be another problem for them this week. But I'm looking at this Ohio State team, and with so much on the line, you get teams at this time of the year that sometimes will play not to lose instead of playing to win. And you're laying double digits on a road to a team that has nothing to lose. So that means it's fourth and two. Michigan can gamble. What do they have to lose? And you want to talk about revenge. Michigan led that game last year against Ohio State the entire way until late. Ohio State made that miraculous comeback. Got the game. I think it even went into overtime, didn't it? They, they won, I know they won it by three late. And this is a spot where the roles are reversed because that loss cost Michigan their shot at getting into the championship playoffs last year. What better way to end the season that has been a disappointment than to spoil it for your arch rival? And Michigan's going to leave everything they have out on the field this week. I know, Ralph, you're a big Ohio State fan. But these two teams, you know, they don't like each other. It's going to be a war. You give me double digits, I got to go with the home team here with Michigan. I, I can say two things, one, one for each side. First, uh, for Buckeye backers, it's John O'Corn. 53% one-five ratio on the year against Ohio State's D-line. Uh, that'll be ugly. But uh, I'm also one to look at home road dichotomy and what you're, what you're getting with the Wolverines in the last six years they've only been a home dog twice they beat Notre Dame and they were a 17 point dog to Ohio State in 2013 and they lost that game 42 41 so you're 2 and 0 as a home dog you've only been a home dog six times I mean twice in six years there's a lot to be said for that when you have John uh, Harbaugh uh, as your coach so Marco's best bet on a defensive home dog huge home dog double digit dog Ohio State, the two best teams they've played, you know, well, to actually not even the two best teams, beat, beat, uh, beat Penn State at home, but lose to Iowa on the road. And again, they haven't faced any other great team on the road. Best bet for Marco on Michigan. Remember, Turkey 10. This coupon's valid only Saturday and Sunday because of all of our Black Friday specials. $10 off any package, any handicapper, wagertalk.com. Have a great and safe Thanksgiving week holiday.